Today is it, uh, the 1st of February, February 1, 2024. And uh, I'm recording because I was waked up at 2 o'clock in the night, this night. And uh, it was three very hard knocking and it was just uh, over my head where I was laying in my bed. It was very dense, distinct knocking. Uh, and uh, it like make me, make be uh, sure, make sure that I wake up. Uh, not uh, angry, but be sure I wake up. And um, and then I went up from the bed and and I was thinking I write it down on Facebook uh, that I had this knocking in the air and not uh, at the door uh, it was like uh, it was on the door but as it was just over my head did i knew from uh, fast that it was not on my door and uh, i never think it's someone on the door uh, in the night uh, for me to, uh, to open up the door it, it maybe can be on my door as I am living on the ground and uh, not inside the house yeah, I have my own opening uh, to to my apartment so it can maybe be a knocking on the door but it doesn't matter because i i should never open up the door at two o'clock in the night and um, so i i heard some noise behind it but i i thought it was not belonging to the knocking so I wrote it down on Facebook and then I go back to my bed and it was 2.30 like that in the night and then I suddenly I wake up at 4 o'clock and uh, it it was not knocking on the in the air but it was uh, i saw two women and they were uh, inside the house not my house another house that i don't i it was look more like uh, uh, the home I had, the last home I had when I lived uh, at home, I lived with my mother at the last, last ho house. And uh, the, it was two women and they were about, uh, it's hard because uh, uh, people look different uh, depend on uh, what they wear and the hairstyle and these things but it looked like they were about uh, between 40 and 50 years old and they uh, and uh, how they look like it was like they were in in the light in the late uh, 60s or in the 70s 
and uh, and they were not talking to each other. It was more like they were not angry either. It was this distinct that they were calling for me. And uh, I saw it was uh, like a gray door behind them and I was thinking as I, I was thinking like the house the, where we lived in my mother and I and my brother and sister uh, in that house was it an elevator and I th thought that that gray door was into the elevator but I couldn't see it. So uh, they were standing like angry and not really angry but pay attention to this. Like that they say to me like screaming. And uh, so the, the I understood that noise was behind those three uh, knockings on in there it was uh, they were together but uh, the second time they didn't do the knocking they only want to to show that the, uh, that noise that was behind the, the the knocking was also something I should uh, look at, uh, check out, and understand. And um, they are starting to come now. Uh, it's spirits coming now. So uh, I want to. I hope, uh, I want it and I hope that they should come and tell more why they did that in the night. What was the meaning and what was, what was it they wanted me to understand. And uh, I understand some of it and it's more likely that is a, a symbolic thing they showing me i think uh, in my mind they could maybe say something else when they're coming through in my mind was it uh, our way up to heaven uh, the elevator was not uh, a normal elevator it was to heaven and uh, and they, they, I don't know why they were like screaming at me uh, like I was late. Uh, I say words now that uh, that is uh, symbolic in the spirit because they they start to come into my body. So the, it will be more and more spirit. So the the word was this. The the, the spirit was word word was that uh, it's uh, we are late late. We are late. We need to go into the elevator and start. Uh, going up to heaven. I, that's what they, what I was thinking they were saying, and uh, uh, they are inside me now. So um, I must uh, let them talking. Uh, yeah, the real thing talking to see what what they wanted to say and uh, want me what I should talk t 
telling you. But I have already started to say the message to you that it seems like uh, we are very late. And they are in hurry to send us up to heaven. And, uh, and then you can ask why do they want to, uh, us to go very quick up to heaven. And that uh, doesn't mean with our body like that. What they want us, what they are saying is that you, you need to make, make your decision in where you are and what you un understand and what you uh, know about heaven and uh, what side you uh, you are standing on and uh, it's not a play playing place now uh, the earth is uh, serious to find yourself in where you are. This is spirits talking now because they are inside me. And, uh, and uh, they, um, if I had people around me here, you can help me to ask questions to them. But I don't have, it's only myself here with them. So I don't know really what to ask them about. But they, they are, there is, seems like it is something coming that uh, you need to be on solid ground to be really strong, powerful in, in what you understand about heaven. And, and telling them when they are coming, it's a, it's a force that is coming very soon it, uh, because they were look at me like are you still here you need to come with us to into the elevator and uh, they are going to be here the force but it is also coming from heaven force is and uh, together together against each other it will be a war as it have been a war already but it's gonna be worse and um, i know it's uh, the conflict it's gonna be much bigger conflict and but it's Sometimes is it good with money because it's about money. The war is not not about something else. It's always money and greed. And uh, to to know to know the money that there is to could win. And uh, you need to pay attention to that and think about when you hear about war and that it is, is a, a real, real talking means money, what they can get from those places where they are in war in and uh, 
some countries seem uh, poor, but they are not poor. It's only that the government uh, use those mountains with diamonds and gold to be like a bank, to not open up and dig it out. They have it as a safe uh, for themselves. And uh, the people could go up in a mountain and, uh, and get very much money. But they are, are not thinking like that because it's much work. And you have to invest in... Uh, in money first to could could do your things i i fall to sleep but I think it it was something that was made <clears throat> by them. <clears throat> now they, uh, it is this. It's hard for me to talk because it's a spirit thing. I don't know what they. If they were telling you something, uh, or they did something with you, because the, I I, I was away with my brain, and um, they are three here now, so they. Uh, that's what it was with this knocking, three knockings. And they are three knockings, uh, women here. So I saw only two, but there was one more uh, I saw in, in the night. And... Um, The a woman is saying that the the, the it's uh, gunfire do not uh, get effort. She's saying that it's a uh, it's about uh, more about. Uh, the brain is a as soon as they will see you with a gun in your hand that's uh, where you write uh, we will be right up in in the bo book of death that's you doing on your own own it's no one that do that it's your free will that you hold the gun in your hand and uh, in what she's saying uh, it's a, a symbolic thing also because they are spirit this that is coming through and she's talking about to have the gun can be the word the word in your mouth what you are saying to people that can be like a gun so uh, you should not think about it uh, and when she say gun that it should be literally a gun it isn't 
is their way to to talk that they don't see this gun as we do here on earth because they don't have any gun in heaven they are think thinking differently from us in that way that a gun can mean everything that kill a person it have nothing with a weapon to do in that way that we make a weapon because they don't make weapons is what you are saying what you are acting on that is a weapon can be a weapon so uh, they are on their way out I I will see because I'm going going to bed soon and uh, rest a little and I will see if they coming back again and talk to me and then I need to recording a little longer today we'll see God bless you.